And we have another match in home sweet home. Okay, this guy is at least some of all fears. My last three opponents have been way underleveled, which is not that fun. This guy is slightly underleveled, I can already see. Creep opener on home sweet home. That would be a first, I'm pretty sure. Mm -hmm. What should I go here? Just standard corn, I think. Actually, should we? Could just then this with our own snowball. Force it out of here. That's fine too. Ours is over leveled anyway. It's gonna have lot like three hundred or something. So then we can just place this in front. And then force him to go all the way back here so we get to take some panic points back. Hopefully. It's probably fine. I think the turret opener is also a fine response to a snowball here though. It's just running all the way there. That's fair enough, I guess. Probably Okay, he's still defending it. I was like, what? This is just gonna go heal though. Don't think I can actually place it up there, right? Nah, it will die. Don't want that, obviously. Just take it slow from here. Get a turret out, maybe either Evie or Inoculus. Some good four key at least. Gen's thing could work too. Or maybe we save for something even bigger. Really? Are you sure about that? I don't really care that much about losing these couple points of health. But I should just go here and fireball it, right? You can't actually hit it with anything, can you? No, I don't think you can. The range is here. These two together won't do it. Put this here. Do I even want to put this here? Sure. Let's just go Inoculus here. Don't want to get into another <laughs> trapping game. It takes too long. I mean, it's still fun to do traps, but if they get like a Doom Doom, then it just takes forever. Or some tickles stuff. And they remove your traps and then you gotta lay them down again and like 20 turns later you're ready to play the game. They could actually just place a boomer in front here. Be annoying. That's enough. I'm pretty sure, at least. Yeah, it should always be enough to protect me here. I'm surprised he's not uh, letting these heal up more. I mean, I did the same here. It's not fully healed, but these are kind of important to get a bit higher health. Is that a MoFat he just showed? This MoFat?
What? Rushmore. That's actually a bit of a weird unit to see on this map. The technically speaking, kill this if I want to. Wait, no, I can't. This doesn't reach at all. What am I talking about? <laughs> goes here then we can kind of has a lot more power than me on the board which makes me wonder if this is a bad idea to have this here could just kill this i think ah, whatever we have a lot of keys to respond with saved up I'm leveling this one up too, by the way, not because it's actually good, but just because I uh, kind of have nostalgia of playing with this. I used to play a lot with it. Early on when I didn't have a lot of other high keys, I pretty much used this every other match. He's getting trapped really hard here. Mm, do I want to do that? I mean, I have to kill the crush more for sure. So we probably just do that. This makes sense. As long as it doesn't pull me. It might pull me, actually. Of course it does. Or we just have to let the snowball die then. I hate you can't pre queue actions. Like, this is so bad. Makes me absolutely hate Arena that you can't do this. Like, look at that. I almost didn't get that action off. It's such a bad design decision that they didn't make that. I mean, I'm sure it's just because it's hard to do or. That it takes too many resources for what you gain from it, or something like that. But being unable to like choose, oh, now I want to click here and then not have to wait for the animation to do something else would make the game a lot better because it's really annoying with the way it is right now. Like, I want to be able to choose to shoot this twice and then move this. Not choose to shoot this once, wait for the anim animation, choose to shoot it again, wait for the animation, walk, wait for the animation. Like that is a stupid way to have it work, in my opinion. I don't think he dies if I do this right. He shouldn't, I don't think. We could kill this then. Probably means that we want to do it this way instead. Make it take the damage and then heal it again before we move it forward. Just look at this. I can't move my units, man. Why? Is it like this? Like that was a simple turn and I still almost ran out of time.
don't think you're able to kill this even with whatever you pull from spawn it's not even close <laughs> he's just putting everything into it Moved around really fast there during the last bits of the. I want to go there. Mm. I think I want to do something like shoot this one here. I think we just keep them somewhat safe. Actually, the couple should be. Down here, right? It should be up here. We still have four more keys to spend. So even though this looks kind of even, it's not at all. Levels, man. They matter so much. There's only left there because it has four more. I mean, he's not helplessly on the level, though. Like, you could have over overcome this difference. I've overcome larger differences, I know, at least. He's moving around a lot. Not sure if it's because he's trying really hard or what's going on. I mean, this thing is just dead, right? I'm just going to hit it. Like that. Can you actually kill this then? Yeah, he could. And just sacrifice this, actually. Just get the one keys out of the way so I can actually summon a unit worth a damn. Also, yeah, you can kill my jar cannon here. Or even this, right? You should probably have killed this. I think that was the wrong one to kill. If you could have killed mine, at least. Would that have been enough? Yeah, it would totally have been enough. Should totally have killed the hematic there. Or not the hematic, the... What's it called? Inoculus. There. Mm. Just gonna go... Maggie... To have a bunch of damage. Was fairly mobile too. Because it can go over these and stuff. He did surprisingly well despite the level difference. He should definitely have killed this over the jar cannon though. This is so much big, larger of a threat. And I are not even close really.
actually. We just sacrifice the quagmire here, right? It's not even gonna die actually, so it's not even a sacrifice. We just keep it there. He healed so Okay, I thought I had already moved this, but apparently the game didn't <laughs> agree with that. I think it's still alive, right? Yeah, it still is. It's kind of wild how good this thing is at tanking. at least put up a pretty good fight all things considered compared to the other opponents i had at least because the last couple have been not slightly on the level but way on the leveled